Yo, what is up people? It is your boy Sneebles right here and I hope you guys had a fantastic day once again today. Okay, so as I always say, welcome back again to the channel. Welcome back to another episode of course on our FIFA 22 career mode with the good old MK Dons. Of course, in the Premier League, as you guys may know, if you have forgotten, then yeah, we're in the Premier League. Um, but yeah, it's been a good start. It's not been too bad. It hasn't been too bad, uh, considering obviously we're new to the Premier League. It's going to be tough. We've got a weaker team compared to probably every team that's in there. Um, you know, so in that sense, yeah, it, it's just going to be a tough season. It's going to be tough, um, unless we can still upgrade our team, which we have, but unless we can upgrade it even more than we can do that perfect you know what I mean so um, but yeah it's not been too bad so when I say not too bad I mean the first you know, two league games got two on victories um, which is awesome then we beat Atkinson two on in the cup so it was a good start just in general the whole season itself good start then we lost two on at Evan which you know, sort of spiralled then uh, but we then beat West Brom 3-2 but then got smashed 4-0 to Wolves in our last game which is not good but you know just had a terrible game I didn't expect it to be like that. I expected maybe a lose, to be honest, because the ball's obviously a decent side. Um, but yeah, they just tore us to pieces, literally shredded us. Um, but yeah, so we just have to continue. That is all we can do. So, um, also, I just want to say before we continue this video, apologies for the last one being too long. Um, again, I don't know if you guys like longer videos or shorter videos, I don't know. But also, if it's a long video like that, most times it's because I'm talking about my squad, which is what I want to do at the start of every season if I can. Um, sometimes halfway through the season I'll tell you who I've added and whatever, and yeah, and yeah, just show their stats and if they've improved, um, but yeah, or not improved. Um, but yeah, so, and I like to do that. So if my video is a bit too long, apologies on that one, so. Um, but yeah, so today anyways, on this episode, we have none other than Liverpool away in the League Cup. So this is probably not gonna be a win, so I'm not expecting anything. Um, but hey, we'll go out there and we'll see what we can do. Simple as that. Um, we've got Man City at home after that. Um, you know, it's not probably going to be. <laughs> it's going to be tough that one. Um, and then we've got Chelsea away. So today's video is um, very interesting. So, <laughs> so to, to say the least, it is not going to be easy at all. In all three games, I'm actually going to get battered. Probably, probably going to get battered. So today's video is probably going to be one of the first videos. I've ever had where I've lost all three games. Um, but you know, we're going to go out there and we're going to do what we can do. It is all I can do. Um, but I can see us getting completely smashed. But you know, I don't know. It, what can you do? You just have to do what you can do. Simple as that, right? So that is all we will do. So, um, but yeah, Man City and Chelsea in a row in the league. Are we going to get any points? I don't know. Um, I doubt it. But that's just being honest. because. Yeah, I mean, if we get smashed 4-0 four, four by Wolves, what's Chelsea and Man City going to do? But you know, as I said, you never know what can happen. So, um, but you know, we're going to go ahead with that anyways. We're not going to blab on anymore. Um, we're going to go ahead and put Liverpool in the cup, the third round um, of the uh, Carabao Cup. So, yeah, let's see what we can do here. Hopefully we can get a good start in this video, but if we don't, we don't. It's simple as that. There's not much I can really say on it. We just have to do what we can do. I keep saying the same thing, but you know, I don't know what to say because we're just probably going to get smashed in all three games, to be honest. But again, you never know. So, yeah, going on to this anyways. Liverpool in the third round of the EFL Cup. Let's see what we can do. Oh. <laughs> Six minutes gone and we already won them down. <sighs> Didn't really see what's wrong with that. Defending was nothing wrong. They just got that ball through. It's simple as that. I didn't, I didn't actually see anything wrong with this. Um, yeah, look, David just makes a run there. I don't know where my defenders are, to be honest. <sighs> Again, button-wise, everything else, just whatever. Just me controlling the team. I, I've done nothing wrong, but just stand my ground. And they left the gap open. Not much we can do about it. Oh, come on. I did press the button to shoot. Why is he not shooting? All from that. I don't know if I showed you, but I did press shoot on that and then they just broke. Wow. 2 0 inside 17 minutes. Literally nothing I can do about that. Literally. I said about the first goal, of course, but 
This one definitely I couldn't do anything about. It's a great break from Liverpool, admittedly. You can't do much about it. It's a good finish. What a finish as well. But in general, um, on my attack, I went to shoot. It, it took so long to hit. The the reaction to hit it was. Just, I've said it before about a lot of chances I've had on the game. It just takes so long to react. And then they broke on it. Not much can do about it. Two now. Go on. Yes! How's that gone in? I don't know, but we've got a goal. We have pulled a goal back. I didn't expect that going in at all. That was such a weird goal. It literally, like, it's like it took a deflection, but there was nothing there to take a deflection, right? Unless the defender that I shot past took a touch. I don't know. Um, was that? No, it's not massive. I don't know who that other guy is. Um, but, yeah, it might have taken a deflection there, and then... I still don't know how Allison's not got it, I don't know, but back in it, Taliga gets the old practically. Um, let's see if it counts as, a, as an old goal, actually. No, it does count as Taliga's goal, okay, so it's 2 1. Awesome stuff. We're back in it. Can't Amaral for 2 2. No! How has that not gone in? Bastard. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> Oh, oh, that's really pissed me off. The other two goals, fine, I accept, but that's pissed me off. Tackle the ball, got the ball. How's that gone back to Salah? I do not know. We just literally had a chance, if I showed you it just before, to get back in this for 2-2, and then scores that. That's really, that is actually really, no, come on, be honest, be honest. In the comments, guys, come on, be honest, that's unfair. Look, I've got that ball there. How's that happen? That's the thing with FIFA. Their tackling is actually, I think their tackling is actually awful in this game. I mean, I think everything's awful about this game, to be honest. But, yeah, that's, uh, I mean, it's hugging no one. I mean, look how the game is so broke just for that. It's not a free one. It's not. Oh, God. Get it out. Oh, my. Oh. <laughs> oh. The buttons I pressed to get that ball out. I slid with with my left back and I thought, you know what, I'm going to give a penny away here. Um, not that I wanted to, but I just felt like, yeah, when I slid, I was like, that's got to give a penny away. But I tackled brilliantly, actually. But then, some, I don't know what happened there. I have absolutely no clue how to explain English on that, but... 4-1. Regardless of whether my back's to, 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 to that way, that way I want to pass it, no, it's, no. That's absolutely bad. It really, passing has been so bad in this game. I blocked it. <laughs> in the lead up to that, whether I showed you or not, but the passing. I absolutely do not care whether my back was to the direction I wanted to play it. That should be going through. Simple as that. Um, and this, I think I blocked it. I think I did. Yeah. Just got it past me, I guess. All right, fine. Nah. It should be 5-1. No. At least, I'd say 4-3. We've, honestly, we've done actually quite well. For what I expected, we've done really well. Go on, Bondo. Oh, yeah, I've got... I have to hit the bar, don't I? Yeah, of course. Yeah, it's, it's not 5-1. It isn't. That chance just there... Um, I think my mic's crashed again, as always. It's, it's typical, really. I don't know why I keep doing it. But either way, 5-1. Um, no, the chance I just had there, again, if I showed you it. Um, yeah, 5-1. No, no. It should be, like I said, at least... So keeping their goals, it should be at least 5-3, 5-4. We still should have lost, yes. But we actually had a great game. On, I swear down, we had a good game. Um, they just got through um, the odd time kind of lucky in some ways um, and in some ways my defence just won't up for it but there you go out of the league cup I said we're going to get fresh and we did but I don't think we did really performance wise no so just to show you guys as well um, as you see there uh, on the screen right there we had 60% possession you know, they had 40 you know, we had 7 shots they had 6 just shows how clinical they were of course um, in that sense um, but passes look we made more passes uh, they had to tackle more but you know just, just in general, we had 14 interceptions. We just, we were in general the better side in that sense. How we didn't at least get away with at least, you know, if we lost, fine. But how we didn't get away with at least getting at least three goals, four goals. Just being honest, I just, 
it just baffles me. I know it's, it is what it is, you've got to play what you can play and just go through with it and hope for the best and that's what we did but yeah, just just didn't come our way in the end, simple as that. But yeah, I think we deserved at least something uh, in terms of more goals anyways and I know it doesn't help the result but yeah, I think we were better than what the result says, much better. Okay, so before we get into our next game which is of course Man City, um, which ain't going to be easy at all of course. Um, so we've got this message. Now this is annoying me. So I don't know whether you guys remember in the last video I said about uh, my player Simon Villalba, uh, quality player, good, great little youngster, a Spanish winger. Um, obviously wanted a new contract, right? But I'd already gave him a new contract at the start of the season. Just he wanted like it's funny because he was on like a grand a week, which is incredible for the player that he was, he was or is, should I say? And the the performances he was giving me, you know, he deserved a bigger raise, right? But I went through that contract, so when you go through the screen, you give him a new contract and all that. He only wanted, I think it was like another two grand on top. So in the end, I gave him a three and a half thousand pound a week contract. Now it doesn't sound like a lot, but that's what you wanted, right? We agreed to it. Simple as that. Gave him more years and all that. Then this all happened. So as you see right now on your screen, he um, obviously he came up to us. He wanted a new contract. He wanted a better contract because everyone else was having bigger, you know, bigger pay uh, paychecks, but. I couldn't do anything about it because I just gave him a new contract. Now it's come up with things like this. This I, I think it's another thief, thing that FIFA needs to sort out. So like, what can I do about this? So literally at this rate I'm losing a quality player because of that. Because of FIFA. Y you can't do anything about it. There's nothing you can do. I keep going into it trying to give him a new contract, but I've already gave him a new one. <laughs> so I don't know how long I have to I can wait for. Um, maybe January, because it's a new transfer window or a, a new year itself. I don't know. But what can I do? There's nothing I can do about it. I can't give him a new contract yet. They keep saying things like this. I don't know. It's kind of pissing me off now, but you know, this if he goes, this is why, guys. Because of things like this, it's just, just stupid, really. But yeah, it is what it is. So, on to Man City, anyways. I did say I was going to be Man City next. Um, so, we're just going to go ahead with that uh, after this. So, um, yeah, I don't know what else to say. Man City, they're going to be tough. But can we win it? I don't know. But hey, let's go for the three points. And hopefully we can get something out of it, even a point, even a point. Oh, go on, Thiago. Go on. God, no way. How can I not score that, man? Oh. Don't know how much centre back's not got that. Not only that, we've been the better side. I'm, I might say that a lot. I, I do. I probably do say that a lot, but. We have been so much better than Man City, so much better than they get that. It's a very lucky turn because my defender should be having that. And being honest, you should be having that 100%. Unfortunate, really unfortunate that. Pressing the button. Pressing the button. I'm literally pressing the button and it's not doing it. 2 nil down for no reason. I get the ball here and you're probably thinking why am I dribbling but I've got no time to react. The ball's coming to me so quickly I didn't expect to intercept it just like that. I've got it and I've pressed the button but it's not doing anything so that is why we're 2 nil down. I swear down. I'm not just making up excuses either. Out of all goals, that is 1-0. Simple as that. Um, it's a good play here. Not much to do about it. I don't know where my play is all over. Uh, for the third goal, all over the place. We do not deserve to be 3-0 down in the first half. I kid you not. I swear down to you. I hope I've at least put a few of our chances. We've had at least three decent chances. And it's just not gone in. Decent, just like they've had. Oh, red card for their striker, Martinez. It's not going to do anything for our game, but still 3-0 down. 10 minutes left. But hey, there you go. Red card. <laughs> Come on, Bravo. Oh, he gets us a goal. Alright, we get a goal, but we deserve something. It's, it doesn't do anything. It does sound made for goal difference, but... <sighs> We played so much better. I said this about Liverpool. Honestly, we played so much better than the score says. Um, but you know, 
get a bit away with that. But there you go, Bravo gets us a goal. It's something, I guess. I don't know. All right, it is three one. Um, it's unfair. It is unfair. Uh, I can't remember their goals to be fair. I can't actually remember how Man City scored their goals, but as far as I remember, they don't deserve them. They literally don't. Um, we we were all over them. I give I give the first thirty to forty minutes. So just before half time, it was definitely all over them. Hundred percent all over them. Um, so yeah, unfair, really unfair. But hey, we just have to take on the gym because there's no, nothing I can do about it. You know, the game's going to cheat against you. That's what it is. And I'm just being honest. Okay, we was all over them. Just wouldn't go in for us. Um, we had a good, I think three or four decent chances I mean absolute solid chances still don't go in um, but you know it is what it is. there's just literally nothing I can do about it so we move on and there you go 3-1 defeat okay so on to our last game of this video we have none other than Chelsea yeah two defeats in a row again I said this at the start didn't expect anything because well, it's Chelsea um, it's Liverpool and of course Man City then obviously Chelsea it's not gonna be as easy um, at the three is probably the easiest, as in, in terms of where Chelsea are, they're seventh. They're not having the most strongest of starts to the season, but they're still there. They're still there, still going to be tough. Um, obviously, they're only just in front of us by goal difference, as in we've got the same points. But if we can get three points here, or, you know, I'll be, I would actually be actually happy with a point, because I just want to get these three tough games out of the way. Uh, we played what we could do. We, we've got a goal in each of the games, but just got technically smashed in the end. Um, but... I think Man City out of both games we've played, we should have got a win against. Surprisingly out of both both teams. Um, but you know, we just didn't. It's simple as that. There's not much you can do about it. You just gotta do what you can do, as I say it every time. So on to that next game. Let's see what we can do. Chelsea, who sits seventh. Can we get three points against these? I don't know. Go on. Oh, it's a great connection, but still can't score. All over them just like I was against Man City, man. Well, that's a, yeah, that's a red card. Trevor Chalabar. Um, that's how you say his name anyways. Gone behind on, on Horvat there. He's sent off and that could be a big boost to try and get his three points. Still nil nil, 37 minutes gone. We're definitely the better side, so hopefully we can do something here with now sending off. Come on. Really, <sighs> this game is just so unfair. It's not great defending, admittedly. That Lukaku got brilliantly in behind my defence there, just the, the, somehow got an absolute pace behind uh, my defence as he just sprinted past and then just the ball back. Nothing really wrong with it, but you know, good control and then the volley. I think he should be doing better. Yeah, I do. I do. I really do. But there you go. 1-0, and it's not deserved for them. Come on. Yes! It is 1-1. Fully deserve it. Finally. Jesus. And Amrai, of all people, gets in. I say that because he's not been in fantastic form. I started him to have thought, why not? But he gets in that position, slots it in. Honestly, we deserve at least a goal. And we finally get it. And it brings us level back on terms. Awesome stuff. Come on, let's push that win. Come on, Ronnie. You've got the pace. You've got the pace. You've got the finish. 2-1. Come on. We are 2-1 up. First time in this game. And I'm Ronnie with a great finish. Puts us 2-1 up. Fully, fully deserved. What a game. It, honestly, this match has been brilliant. We've played brilliantly. Just like we did against Man City, but just obviously in the end. Continue three goals and yeah, just obviously decisively lost three one. But you know, oh, honestly, if we can hold on to this and get a full three points, I'll be very happy. Very happy. Get in there. Two one victory at Stamford Bridge, our first ever game against Chelsea, and it's at Stamford Bridge, as I said, and we get victory. One nil down to winning two one. Honestly, fully deserved. I don't care what anyone thinks. Of course, I've played the game. I've not showed you obviously every single second of the game, but we have played so well. As you see, Amrani had five attempts, got two of them, which is brilliant. Um, but it just shows you we were so good. Honestly, we we're so good. 
Um, we deserve, honestly, deserve these points 100%. I swear down to you, we deserve this. I'm really happy for the boys to to get the points. Honestly, to get, I would have been happy with a point, seriously. But we got three. Fantastic. Can't ask for any more. Great stuff. On to bigger things. Okay, so that is the end of that video there. Hope you guys, of course, enjoyed, as always, three massive games we played. Yes, we've got two defeats. And, uh, of course, you know, um, obviously, we, we beat uh, Chelsea, which is awesome to, to have. It's not what I expected, to be honest. Um, well, I expected to lose all three games. But all three games, especially, I'll, I'll go as, as high as Man City and Chelsea. Uh, we play really well. Liverpool, I think we still play well, but just... In here. you know we got smashed literally absolutely smashed but you know we, we've done all right we actually done all right for ourselves anyway i think we just we tried and, you know didn't succeed as great as what we could have but you know it, it's not going to be that easy against three of the biggest teams in the premier league you know what i mean obviously but we're getting liverpool in the cup so that won the premier league obviously so we uh, lost that and obviously you know uh obviously out of the cup and that is what it is you know you can't do much about it of course, Man City, uh, if we did beat them, it would have been their first defeat of the season. They remain unbeaten as well as United and Liverpool. Um, and then obviously beating Chelsea. We beat Chelsea, you know, 2-1 um, to come back from one of down, which we fully deserve. Awesome stuff, you know what I mean? So, um, but yeah, so as you see there, four wins, three defeats, uh, 11 goals scored, 14 conceded. Yeah, not a bad goal difference, I guess. It's not, it's not the worst. Um, but yeah, 12 points on the table with a fifth. Not bad for our first couple of videos. Uh, into the Premier League, you know, I'm really happy with that. Played some solid games, and uh, got some solid results in most ways, uh, except obviously that thrashing to Wolves. That that wasn't good, but um, is what it is. I mean, we're above Wolves, though, so I'm, I'm not bothered. <laughs> um, but yeah, so yeah, it is what it is. We've done really well, to be fair. Um, so going back on, like I said, the results, just go back on it. Um, so yeah, as you see there, 2-1 over Chelsea. Then obviously we lost 3-1 to Man City just before that, and we lost 5-1 to Liverpool. Again, doesn't sound great, but hey, they're going to be a tough game. They're going to be tough games. If you didn't expect them to be tough, then you just don't know your your football. <laughs> Simple as that. It's going to be hard, obviously. So, um, but yeah. So, obviously, next we have Watford um, in a couple of weeks, uh, in a week or so's time. Then Tottenham, um, and then we have West Ham. So, yeah. So they'll be the first, uh, the next three games, unless things change um, in our season. So, hopefully, we can do well. That's all I can say on that. So I hope you guys, of course, enjoyed. As always, leave a like, of course, and subscribe. Be much appreciated. And thank you guys for the support on this channel and this series as well. And uh, yeah, until then, take care. And of course, as always, peace.